Hey guys, welcome to another YouTube video. My name is Ray Brizzy and in today's video we're actually going to be talking about how to transfer video files from your computer to your iPhone or from your iPhone to your computer. Let's talk about it. Alright guys, so the other day I got a question about how do I transfer uh, video files and stuff like that from a buddy of mine and uh, it was really 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 crazy. Uh, he was asking how to make the video uh, files smaller but if you make them smaller you can't make them bigger and a bunch of other stuff like that so let's get to it. So you're going to want to download this app called WeTransfer. And so WeTransfer is a website where you can transfer videos. Uh, the free version, you can only transfer up to two gigabytes of video, but if you're only doing videos for like Instagram or even if you're trying to transfer photos, it's all pretty easy and it's what I mostly use and it's what a lot of other creators use. So it's already easier for you to get adjusted to their platform and stuff. And so yeah, so you're gonna download the app and I'll show you what the app looks like. Let me record on my phone real quick and I'm recording on my phone now. So I'm on my phone and you're gonna see it on the screen either this side or that side and uh, let me show you the app. So this is what the app looks like. It's called WeTransfer and some of these are the files that I transferred to myself but you can also uh, transfer files um, from your photos or videos and so I don't have any video here besides the one that I'm gonna be sending uh, in a bit but um, yeah, so it's pretty straightforward and easy. You just share the file, you pick on the photo that you want, and then let's put add, and it imported the photo, it's creating the link, and it's uploading, and let's say I wanna mail it to someone, so we just click on the little mailbox, and put, uh, put whatever email that you wanna put, and boom, bam, easy, sent. So, that's the first way to do it. So how to transfer it from your phone to uh, yourself. And then the other way, um, the vice versa way. So if you're trying to transfer a video file, uh, so all you really have to do is you don't have to download an app. So you just go, hold on, let me try recording on this. So give me a moment. All right guys, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to your desktop, um, you're gonna pull up wetransfer.com and there's two versions. The first version is the free version and the second version is the wetransfer pro. You could send more files, but if you're just sending like Instagram video files and stuff like that, they shouldn't be that big because it's a one minute video. And so you just go to the free one, um, that's the one that I use all the time. Uh, and then you just put the email you're gonna send it to and then you can add a little message and then you just select the file from your folder and that's all you really have to do all right guys so right now like I showed you guys earlier I made that little clip of just showing you what I did on my phone and so I'm actually gonna transfer that so I'm gonna click add and it's uploading the item and I'm gonna send it to myself to put it on this video and I'm sending it and it's still uploading but as you guys are gonna see I practically just uploaded the video on using WeTransfer and I like using WeTransfer because it usually keeps the quality but um, like I said that's all you really have to do and if you do have to transfer bigger files you might have to go with the WeTransfer Pro but I think it's really worth it it's just really easier but most of the time I don't even have the WeTransfer Pro uh, version so I just use the free because the video files aren't really that big if they're bigger than like let's say 10 gigabytes and stuff you might not be able to transfer it but um, yeah that's pretty much it let me know what you guys think and hopefully this video was super helpful for you guys I hope you guys have a great rest of the day peace